I welcome all the learners to this course on selection and integration of technology in educational processes. I am Dr. Ajit Kumar, Assistant Professor from School of Education, IGNO. Friends, in this video lecture, I will be giving a small understanding about what this course is about. Friends, there are different modes of education. Say for example, face-to-face -face education, which we also call conventional education or traditional education. Then we have open and distance learning, ODL system. Then we have online education and also we have a mix of both face-to-face -face and online education, which is the blended education. So one side we have different modes of education and on the other side we have different technologies also. In other words, we say information and communication technology. So there are different technologies or ICTs, for example, audio, video, images, e-text, open education resources, virtual reality, gamification, artificial intelligence, social networks, learning management system, etc. So there are different technologies or ICTs. When we talk about the educational processes, it includes teaching learning, communication, assessment, and management of teaching learning activities. So friends, we have different modes of education, different technologies, and different educational processes. Many a times the teachers, when they are engaged in the teaching learning process, finds difficult to choose a suitable technology in the teaching learning process. So this course, in general, I would say, would help you to get an idea about, awareness about the different technologies which are available for teaching learning processes. And this will also help you to get an idea about how you will choose a suitable technology and how you will integrate that in the teaching learning processes. So in broad, once you complete this course, you will be able to select and integrate suitable technology or ICT in the educational processes. So in general, this will be the learning outcome of this course. Now friends, regarding the admission and structure of this course, the admission is through the Swayam platform of Government of India. Now about the eligibility, those who have bachelor's degree in any discipline are eligible to take admission in this course. This course is having six credit. This course will run for 20 weeks and during the course you will get online and offline support also. Now what the learners are expected to do? In every week you will find one module. Basically this module will be an e-text. So you are expected to read that e-text. You will also find open educational resources, video lecture and web links. You will also find discussion forum questions. You will also see assignments or activities. You will also find quizzes in some weeks. Now friends, I'll be talking about the evaluation, how you will be evaluated after completing this course. There are two types of evaluation, one the continuous evaluation or the continuous assessment which will carry 30% weightage while the term and examination carries 70% weightage. So once you successfully complete this program, you will be awarded the certificate by Indira Gandhi National Open University. After enrolling into this program, if you have any queries or if you have any problems, you are always free to contact. The contact details are given. I hope after completing this program, you will be in a position to use different technologies in the teaching learning processes. Thank you.